it is very important to understand that wars now are not the traditional wars that we have. It's not about bombs, it's not about airplanes, it's about spreading a culture. Uh, my name is Abdul. I'm 36 years old. I joined the Air Force in 1996 and I graduated in 2000 as a fighter pilot and until 2008 I worked in the Air Force. I retired in 2008. Now I study multimedia communication uh, in San Francisco, the Academy of Art. This is my first semester and I'm gonna finish within a year hopefully, and uh, start my career in multimedia. Multimedia is uh, the future. You can start a war with one video, and you can end the war with one video. You can, uh, you can make up stories, and nobody will, will notice even. But within a certain amount of time, someone will discover, and he will tell the whole world about your story that you made up. The Arab Spring redefined the importance of multimedia. It's a whole different view to multimedia, especially with the revolution of the Internet and websites like YouTube and uh, Twitter, Facebook, and all those uh, websites and how powerful it is and how can you do with it. So I believe we have a big um, uh, duty to, to let the world know who we are and what we, uh, what we are all about and spreading our culture, telling people um, how beautiful and how amazing, how exciting is our culture. I'm like a freedom, a freedom guy. I'm like a bird. I fly, literally. So uh, I think I need more freedom. That's what I was looking for when I start flying, freedom. And the, the, the feeling that you have when you fly, you will never experience this in any different uh, activity. Freedom is a big issue for me. I want to speak freely. I want to say what's in my mind. And I believe I have a lot to say and a lot of stories need to be uncovered, in, in the, especially in, in the Arab world. And I'm going to try my best to improve my skills, to make sure that I'm trying to uncover the truth and try to help people with all the skills I gained by studying multimedia.